the story of PIPAC. Cancer is the term used when cells grow and gather, and sometimes spread. Sometimes a cancer tumor can be removed, but often medicine is used to fight the cancer cells. Chemotherapy, the medicine that treats cancer, has traditionally been delivered intravenously, meaning that it travels throughout the body looking for cells to kill. Unfortunately, it kills some healthy cells along the way and comes with a long list of serious side effects. Standard chemotherapy doesn't reach the tumor cells spread within the abdomen very well. That's why Professor Mark Raymond in Germany developed a new way for this medicine to be delivered. But first, a short anatomy lesson. Did you know that the organs within the abdomen are enclosed in a big sac to keep them safe? This creates a space where the organs all sit comfortably, but also means that when cancerous cells break free, they can adhere to the lining of the sac or other organs, or float freely within that space. After much investment and research, a new chemotherapy system has been developed to attack these cells and for the treatment of abdominal cancers, including bowel, ovarian, stomach, pancreas and more. Pressurized intraperitoneal aerosol chemotherapy, or PIPAC for short, delivers the medicine differently. The chemotherapy drug is nebulized with carbon dioxide to create an aerosol. This is then sprayed into the abdominal cavity where it can kill the cancer cells at the site. A microinjector pump is inserted into the abdominal cavity and then sprays the chemotherapy directly into the sac. The medicine distributes evenly throughout the cavity, coating each of the organs as well as the lining. The gas targets the cancer cells directly, penetrating tumor tissue with a much higher rate of success than other chemotherapy delivery methods. PIPAC helps to stop the cancers from spreading further and may slightly shrink the tumour. This results in better pain management and less symptoms for cancer sufferers, improving their quality of life. It's with thanks to the generosity of donors that the Hospital Research Foundation can provide this equipment to hospitals to treat patients in need. And you can help hospitals get access to more equipment just like this sooner. Donate now. Hospitalresearch.com.au